They have deleted all of my progress here in Minecraft Prisons, and that is because the reset is coming tomorrow. On Saturday, the server is going to be reset for all of you people to come and join and progress with me live because we are going to be we're going to be one of the best this season, guys. So let's go over some details of the brand new reset because this is the big summer update with absolutely huge new things, which we need to go over today, take a look at, and give you guys the first exclusive access and look at it. And we're also going to announce a giveaway that's going to be starting tomorrow for a very very uh expensive item if you will yes hello everybody and welcome into the showcase episode or video for the brand new akuma season um like i said everything's been reset i'm kind of on my account right now we have a pickaxe level 500 just so i can uh you know show you guys some things and go over a couple of things today and uh we're just gonna kind of see all of the brand new features and how everything is going so i think i'm gonna start by going over a couple of the uh more familiar things with you guys the things which you guys may already know so let's start with uh actually i'm trying to think of where we should start let's start with some brand new enchants a new enchant that has been added to the server so this is going to be a late game enchant i'm trying to find out where it is right now because i've only heard about it i haven't seen it here it is right here it's a gem enchant and it's called dragon hammer essentially what this does is it combines the dragon's like eye or whatever it was called with jackhammer so essentially when you mine the full layer you basically get um it, like it basically can mine every block virtually so it kind of combines the two that we've had on previous season and and becomes a very very op late game enchant so that is kind of a brand new addition slash merger of uh, two enchants that we had last season and uh, just kind of changes up the way that that's going to work because the the whole point of this season is that there's kind of going to be brand new metas there's going to be brand new things like that now another thing to pick up on what has been revamped and changed in regards to what we had previously is actually the way that prestiges now work guys so as you guys will know prestiges you get them just by mining you fill up this and then you must prestige now the daily cap on prestige prestiges is now 10 rather than 5 but the uh, the kind of amount of prestiges that you can get is now completely uncapped there is no max prestige you are you're going to essentially continue to prestige throughout the entire season now every five times you prestige you're actually going to get one of these things right here which is a prestige ticket now when you open up this prestige ticket it's going to give you a random token multiplier i believe the values are between 1.1 times and 3.5 times it's going to be a 15 minute one so let's actually go ahead and uh, open one up real quick oh, okay here we go so it's going along right now. We're going to get ourselves a 1.8 times. So that's a yikes. Although it's still bigger than a boost that I have right now. So we, 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 would, we would go ahead and use that. But basically, yes, it can go up to three and a half times. So you're kind of looking to try and get that. So it's another incentive to prestige. Now, skill points are still there for prestiging. So that means that, of course, we do still have the uh, do still have the skill tree, which you guys can go to the end of. And we now have a prestige shop, but there's only a potato in it because, uh, you know, it, the, the final, final things are coming. <laughs> Can't leak everything to you guys uh, before it's out, you know. But essentially, you get one point per prestige and then you'll be able to purchase things from the shop like the brand new contrabands. So contrabands have had a little bit of a revamp this season. We now have a tier one, tier two, and tier three contraband crate. And this is one of the most requested things. The tier three contraband crate actually has the ability to get store coupons and the start of the world crate from. Now these will be obtained by keys, quests, challenges, kits, etc. Stuff like that. Obviously tier one will be a lot more common than tier two or tier three. Tier two, you can actually get a tier three, I believe, out of it. So it's kind of a little bit of a cycle. But yes, let's, uh, let's open up the three three tiers and see if we can get anything good for ourselves right now. We may as well do a little bit of an opening since we're here and since we're uh, since we're ready and, to, and want to take a look at these brand new crates. Two rank keys. Okay, nothing crazy from those, but honestly, uh, you know, we'll, we'll take them. We'll take them. Now, if you guys did check out the uh, the sneak peek, then you'll know what this is, but the wasteland is a brand new feature. Essentially, the wasteland, uh, the, the best way that I can put it, if you guys have ever played like the tycoon games and stuff like that, that is essentially what this is. So essentially, you start spawning in mobs. Every three of the same mobs you kill will will give you uh will give you a thing towards uh, or will will combine if you kill three of the same ones it will combine into the next tier of mob if that makes sense so for example when i kill all three of these right now they're gonna combine into the next tier of mob and that's kind of how that's gonna work so let's go ahead and let this combine into the next tier there we go they all combine together we now have a cursed shambler so uh you guys see kind of how that works but basically you're gonna use this place you're gonna grind up then you're gonna send off your gold mine when this comes back it's gonna have rewards in it which will help Help you in prisons you can then go ahead over to this guy upgrade the drop rates and all that kind of stuff of all the mobs in here but this is kind of a thing that you that, that you kind of want to grind the entire season um the higher the mob you kill the better the loot from uh, the gold mine and stuff like that so you just kind of grind your way up this is a little side quest uh you know a side quest from prisons i won't explain it too much because there is a whole showcase video that i made on it um on the akuma mc discord and, and places like that so yeah if you guys uh, do need any more information on it then it's all there but it's 
potentially going to be a very, very cool thing, which we'll do a full video on at some point as well. Now, for this next thing, I don't really have too many details or too many uh, things to show you about it, but I will mention it. There is basically a brand new event on the server called an Emerald Rush. Now, essentially what this is, it's like an engaging event for everyone to participate in. Um, it's basically a competition for who mines the most blocks in a certain period of time, and you will basically get rewarded for your placement in that. So, you know, you can win contrabands and, and kind of stuff like that. So, it's it's not really something that I can, it's not really something that I can show you guys right now. However, it is there, and when it does happen, of course, we'll, we'll make sure to make a video about it uh, at later, later at a later date, but it's a brand new event, basically, that you guys can all, uh, you know, partake in and take part in. Now, one of the biggest, if not the biggest things of the brand new season is runes, okay? And runes are essentially, uh, the way that I can describe it to you guys the easiest, they're just extra enchants, really. But when you rank up, you basically get rune points right here. Now, uh, runes are pretty expensive, but if you go into slash runes, you will have to fill out a set of requirements to unlock these slots. You can have up to three slots. We have one right now. I don't have any runes on me, but basically you can forge runes in here by using the, uh, by using the forges and the basic one is 200 rune points. The good forge is uh, 600 points and then the max one is 1k. So depending on which one you pick will depend on the kind of chances you get in good runes. So for this video, I'm just going to show off my best or the best and favorite one, which is the level 10 uh, mortar madness runes. So if we go into runes and we apply this bad boy right here, watch what it's going to do. This is essentially going to make my, uh, going to make my mortar over here. Hopefully it's, yeah, it is built. This mortar is basically just going to go off. I think the proc rates are all set for our, for our feature video. So it is going to go off literally every block I mine. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what this does. Basically this one just has a chance to proc your, proc your mortar a lot of times. And as you guys can see, it's, uh, it's pretty overpowered. It, do, it, it, it does a good amount of work for me. <laughs> Let's be honest. Uh, we're literally not having to touch anything. So Zeus is chilling. Zeus is going ham right now. Everything's going ham. Like, yeah, it's, 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 it's pretty crazy to say the least. But essentially, there are a whole bunch of different runes. Again, if you want to check out all the runes in depth, then there is a rune, um, a rune showcase video, which uh, should have gone out by now, which you guys should be able to check out all of these runes. But we will do videos probably on each one of these during, you know, throughout the season and all that kind of stuff. So guys, with all that said, we've kind Kind of gone over the brand new features now obviously what is actually going to happen this season is we're going to end up having a very interesting and uh, competitive season of prisons because of all the brand new stuff it's going to create brand new metas and uh, honestly i'm just excited for that now as always we are going to be launching an infinity rank giveaway on episode number one of the brand new season so the start of the world episode which will be the next should be the next video out on the channel once that video comes out there is going to be an infinity rank giveaway on there so stay tuned for that because that is how you can win the top rank uh we actually pretty much much only just ended the previous one so uh yeah we, we are going to be doing that so make sure you guys stay tuned for that in the first episode of the brand new season so much stuff and so much to see the server launches at 2 p.m est tomorrow which i think is 7 p.m gmt make sure you guys are on for it i'm going to be there i would love for you guys to be there and yeah that is going to be it for me today hopefully you guys have enjoyed the little bit of a showcase um of the brand new stuff this season of course we've got a brand new spawn as well don't forget that this spawn is pretty epic for the summer update 2023 akuma mc coming join me for the brand new map. I'd love to see you guys online. That is going to be it for me today and I'll see you all in the next episode or first episode of Akuma OP Prisons.